Welcome back to A Moment in History. I'm Seth Udinsky. In this episode, let's go back thousands of years to explore one of the oldest and most impressive architectural achievements in human history. Now, these massive structures have stood for over 3,000 years as a reminder of a now dead but once mighty superpower. They are a staple of the Middle Eastern desert, and they have a poignant connection to the biblical narrative as well. Let's travel across the Atlantic and back to the ancient world to explore the mighty pyramids of ancient Egypt. Now, pyramids were a common structure in the royal culture of ancient Egypt. Between 5,000 and 4,000 years ago, when the practice became commonplace, the pyramids were built as magnificent tombs to house the dead pharaohs. Now, the Egyptians believed, much like the Romans after them, that their kings were divine, having been appointed lordship by the gods and thus deserved a divine resting place. Now, though pyramids existed all throughout the different ages of the Egyptian empire and all across the empire itself, the ones we know today are the three great pyramids of Gaza. They are the only one of the seven wonders of the ancient world that have lasted to this day. Now, it's unknown exactly how they were built or who built the pyramids, whether the Egyptians did it themselves or they hired workers or they used the work of slave labor. There is substantial evidence that they were not built by aliens for obvious reasons, so I'm sorry for our conspiracy theorists out there, but still fun to speculate. Well, as can be expected, the pyramids became treasure troves full of priceless artifacts that were buried alongside the Egyptian kings. There are few treasures left in the pyramids that still stand today, though, mainly because throughout the centuries, robbers have pillaged the pyramids and taken the treasure. Now, there is a poignant biblical connection to the pyramids, as I, as I mentioned earlier, particularly in the Exodus account in the second book of the Old Testament. The pyramids serve as a physical reminder of the height of Egypt's ancient world dominance, and that dominance was smashed to pieces when the God of the Hebrews delivered his people from the captivity of the Egyptians. God exposed the false pantheon of the Egyptian gods with 10 devastating plagues. And after the 10 plagues, God demonstrated his awesome power one final time by parting the waters of the Red Sea so that his people could cross over into deliverance. Thanks so much for joining me once again for a moment in history.